Hi guys, welcome back to my channel today. So I have this really quick video for you guys and it's just a lash tutorial. You guys have requested this video so many times. It's one of the most requested videos on my channel even though I still apply my lashes on camera sometimes when I'm filming but you guys wanted an in-depth one so here I am don't forget to like share subscribe and also don't forget to follow me on social media my Instagram and my snapchat and let's get right into this tutorial another disclaimer guys if you do see braids from the back of my hair in this tutorial please permit me I'm just too lazy to take it out so I just slapped this wig on top of my head it's a wig guys it's a wig the wig is by Divas Wigs by the way it's so versatile and so good I'm going to leave it down in the description box below if you're interested okay okay the lashes I'm going to be using are these lashes by Lash Line and here are they Ooh, that looks great this is in the style Lady Lush and this is what it looks like it's very natural looking and this is how it comes so yeah most lashes strip lashes they come in this kind of plastic container so you have the lash band sitting right on top of it although these lashes are natural looking i'm going to be stacking them that's placing one on top of the other for more volume to my lashes you don't have to do that that's just my preference because i want the full look I, I figured i'll just take the advantage to show you guys how to stack it in case you want to do that as well but if you don't you're going to just skip to the next step so to stack it here's what i do i take the first lash in my hand and i just place it right on top right on top of the other lash and make sure it's aligned before taking it out after making sure they are aligned together it looks something like this it looks like just one lash like one normal lash and this is what you usually have so the next step you want to do is to apply your glue now the lash glue i'm going to be using is the duo lash glue in the dark tone it's kind of old and busted but yeah this is the duo eyelash adhesive dark tone glue so the first thing i like to do is just to pop out the glue like so so i've popped out the glue as you can see the glue is gray it's gonna dry black though so now i have my lashes on my tweezers and the lash glue right here so what i'm going to do is just to apply the lash glue onto so i came closer so you guys can really see what i'm doing i'm just applying the lash glue on the lash band and i'm just spreading it out evenly so it just sits nicely on the lash line and you want to kind of concentrate on the edges of the lash band most especially because that's the part that tends to rise up the most so just concentrate there and add more glue there if you need to and you don't need to put too much glue to be honest so I'm just going to place that down and then do the same thing for the other lashes, the other set of lashes for the second eye. So after you've applied the glue, you want to wait for like 10 to 30 seconds. The dual lash glue usually dries very fast, so you want to be careful. You want to keep looking at it until it gets tacky. Sometimes you can touch it, but I really don't like to touch it because... I really don't want to mess up the glue pattern but when you see it's turning a darker color that's when you know it's ready so i'm going to be using my fingers to apply the lashes on this eye and then the tweezers for the next one you want to kind of bend the lashes and i'm just bending them slanted like that and the reason i'm bending it is because i need it to be flexible and so now i'm just going to look down and then place it on top of my lash line it's best to start by placing the middle first because that way it gives it a balance so it's stuck on the lash line and then you can go ahead and adjust the sides however you want it and you have to be careful so you don't move the glue around too much it's kind of hard but you will get the hang of it eventually i like to look down because i feel like it makes it easier for me to place it on top of the lash line on top of my lash line i want to kind of place it very close to where your lash line is as close as possible then adjust the edges most especially because those places seem to rise up the most especially the front part that's why i take so much time to do that part i'm just trying to push it in and just placing it into my lash line so 
now this is where I really need tweezers. I'm just trying to bring my lashes, my own real lashes and the falsies together. And that's why I'm using the tweezers to, to kind of clamp them together. And next we're going to move on to the part where I use the tweezers. I'm not so good at this part because I honestly cannot use tweezers to save my life. So I'm just going to be using the tweezers just to adjust it and just to place it on it i'm doing this for the sake of those that prefer tweezers so i'm just using the tweezers the same way i use my fingers and i started with the middle and then i'm going on to the edges and just adjusting it and just placing it right on top of my lash line placing the lash band right on top of my lash line and then adjusting it however i need it to be successfully applied lashes I'm just going to go in with this spoolie and just try to blend my real lashes with my falses so you want to just brush off brush off and I already applied mascara before applying the lashes and that way you get to avoid having product on your lashes and your lashes get to last really long when you do that so I'm just going to keep brushing that up just to make sure everything is aligned. You don't want to see some flying upwards and some flying that way. That way. And you just want to get everything in formation. Okay, lashes. Now let's get in formation. Look to me. Slide check. <laughs> so now it's just one last step and that step is just to camouflage the lash line up there you don't want to see the obvious I don't know y'all can see that but you see the crown we don't want to see that we don't want to see that line this part isn't totally necessary but the fact that I have eyeliner on is making it quite obvious so I'm going to go with the same eyeliner I had on before which is the NYX and I'm just going to go on top of that lash line forgive the faces I'm going to make when I do this because like I can't afford to mess up my makeup <laughs> And that is all like it's so it's so much more easier than you think it is you just have to keep practicing and keep trying even as I am I still make mistakes every day sometimes I get lash in my eye you know sometimes I get glue in my eye you know and I can't get the lashes right sometimes in the same angle but like we're all learning so I'll just say just try your best and just keep practicing you get the hang of it one day and you don't always have to do what people tell you to do you can find your own find your own place like when i was learning how to apply lashes everywhere was like oh using tweezers is easier using tweezers is easier i tried that it wasn't working and then i found my place which is just the hand the hands like i really can't use tweezers so i'm just going to tell you to find your own place find where you're comfortable with just keep practicing till you get it and we can all be lashing together so yeah that's it for this tutorial i hope you guys enjoyed it don't forget to like share subscribe and also don't forget to follow me on social media my instagram and my snapchat which is all and i'll see you guys in my next video bye